Well, a special graduation took place today in mid-Michigan, one that not only changes lives, but saves lives as well. That's right. Tonight marks a fresh start for a handful of people who work through Eaton County's Adult Circuit Drug Court. Jeff Sanchez is here for you with more from the graduates and their families who have high hopes for the future. Josh? That's right, Sherry Siobhan. Today's graduation was a fitting end to National Drug Court Month, with officials of this and other treatment courts in Eaton County saying that they're the best ways to get people in recovery the support they need. A family who spoke with us says this program gave their loved one the chance to improve and start that new life. And for one graduate, she's taking that second chance to give back to others. It was a long road. Um, I came from the bottom. I was struggling in active addiction and Today I'm not. I'm sober, I'm happy, I'm clean, and now I'm free. Anastasia Elliott has a new lease on life. She's one of several recent graduates of Eaton County's drug court program, and today they marked their milestone with their coaches and family by their side. Officials with the 56th Circuit Court say this treatment program is a critical piece in helping people recover from addictions to drugs and alcohol. For Elliott, she says it helped her achieve more than she ever imagined. I am alive and I just feel great. Elliot now plans to help other people weighed down by addiction as a new employee with Lifeboat, a recovery program in mid-Michigan. Elliot's mom, Angel Tyler, says it was difficult seeing her daughter struggle, but it all turned around when Elliot hit rock bottom and was arrested. If she's not ready to do it, it's not going to work anyway. She's not going to work the program. So when she got arrested and she was like, what am I doing with my life? And here we are two years later. It's a program director of community corrections, Melanie Arkenbach, takes pride in. It is the single most greatest joy I get from my job on a personal level is watching them achieve those small goals along the way, the bigger goals. And then, yes, graduation is just the icing on the cake. Elliot says the long journey taught her lessons on determination and that recovery is possible. If you want it bad enough, you'll get it. Go to those meetings, find that sponsor, do what works for you. Now, Arkenbach says more than 130 people have passed their treatment court program since it started back in 2007. Last year, the Department of Justice awarded more than $29 million to similar drug court programs around the country. Sherry, Siobhan. Thank you, Josh. We have new 